All right, coming up next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. All right, here she is, ladies and gentlemen, really as well-rounded a mixed martial artist as we have in the UFC at present. Not gonna wow you necessarily in any one area, but plus skills in every discipline of mixed martial arts, and a handful for anyone in this division, just about anywhere the fight goes. With her skill set, she is comfortable anywhere in that octagon, a scary proposition for the rest of her fellow contenders. This girl is a very well-rounded mixed martial artist, and the advantage to that is she's comfortable no matter where the fight takes place. If her opponent wants to stand, she's comfortable there. If her opponent wants to try to take her down, she has excellent defense. If the fight goes to the ground, she has an excellent ground game. So she is fully well-rounded, and because of that, she is much more confident no matter where the fight takes place inside the octagon. All right, here she is, ladies and gentlemen, making her way to the octagon, so the wait is nearly over for this rivalry matchup here tonight. These fighters do not like each other. That is not breaking news. If you followed this fight during fight week, the bad blood getting up in each other's faces at the weigh-in. We'll see who emerges in this rivalry matchup here tonight. This girl is an excellent striker. Very fast hands, excellent Muay Thai, good boxing, very good takedown defense, and she is an aggressive pressure fighter. All right, just about ready for live action. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. More than five years apart, with some differences in height and a similar reach. Here once more, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record on four wins, four losses. She stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Lover. And now introducing your opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of seven wins, no losses. She stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Indianapolis, Indiana, Butcher. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? Here we go. All right, so here we go with round one as we get this rivalry matchup underway. These fighters, of course, do not like each other. They have said they will try to just focus on their skills and letting their skills take over. Easier said than done, of course, when you're sharing the octagon with someone who you have such legitimate disdain for. Oh, nice job staying busy. The offensive onslaught continues. All right, round one is underway. Most anticipated fight here. And how about the power in her leg kicks, her body kicks, she'll go to the head as well. Certainly something the opponent has got to be mindful of here as this fight gets started tonight. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. And trying to stay heavy here as best she can. Nice sweep. Beautiful left hand there. She transitions to full guard. Oh, how good is that, Joe? She postured up and landed the brutal strike to the head. Unbelievable. Do you believe it? Ground and pound knockout. Yes, Joe, just outstanding ground and pound for her to finish her opponent tonight. She was throwing one big shot after the next, not just looking to score, but actually looking to end the fight. We can see it one more time from a different angle. Ground and pound at its finest. And that is the shot that ends this fight. Look at this. All right, the official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine's called a stop to this contest at one minute, 54 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by so the rivalry matchup goes her way here tonight. She can finally exhale. You see her celebrating with her coaches and her teammates.